afternoon. The news continues at 12.30. Bill Bryant and Barbara Bailey reporting for WKYT. A southern Kentucky teenager is recovering after he survived a fall from a cliff. The 15-year-old slipped and fell while raccoon hunting near Lake Cumberland in Pulaski County last night. WKYT's Phil Pendleton talked to rescue workers about the difficult task of saving the boy in our top story at 12.30. I'm actually in Burnside. I'm told the cliff where this happened is very remote, very difficult and unsafe to get to, but they tell me that the cliff looks very much like where the railroad trestle goes across Lake Cumberland. Now, this all happened last night about midnight. We are told by the captain of the Tateville Fire Department he doesn't know how this boy survived. He says he is very lucky to be alive. The boy slipped on some leaves, fell 20 to 50 feet, then fell another 100 feet or so. The rescue took more than four hours, and once they got down to him, they decided to lower him another 100 feet or so to the lake instead of hauling him back up. The area was very hazardous. It was dark and cold, and firefighters tell me they had a lot working against them. Steep cliffs, slate rock that drop off into several different areas. They don't just uh, slope off into the water. So a lot of them are straight down cliffs that slope off from one level to the next level to the next level, and that's what made it so hard. A lot of them, you got briar patches, you have logs that have fallen over. And again, this happened really late last night, but I'm told that is the ideal time to be hunting coons. But the boy had a positive attitude about things. He said, well, at least I was still able to get four coons. In Pulaski County, Phil Pendleton, WKYT. Phil, thank you very much. And the teen apparently has his arm broken in two places, also broke his leg, but is expected to eventually be okay.